Morning, Gemma. Morning, Mom. What are you doing? I'm prepping the turkey. Oh, look at that. I've just wrapped her in bacon so that she keeps all the juices in the breast area. Right. The legs need to be open to cook because they've got lots of bones in so they don't need. Um, I've cut all the neck area out so that he can get right through into right. the middle. Um, and take up, stab myself with scissors. Um, take all the giblets out and trim away any, any excess fat from this area. Um, she's a good turkey, she's nice and um, firm when you touch her. You like you like your birds firm, don't you? You like it. You don't want the meat. You don't want the skin to be too saggy over the top okay. of the bird. You want it to be. Um... We also have small pigs in blankets, the new large pigs in blankets, the new improved large pigs, <laughs> pigs in blankets, and some pork surgery and stuffing balls. And today I am a Jedi. A Jedi. Yeah, I thought. Since Gemma's had her pyjamas on for most of the vlogs, <laughs> today you get me. So this was a present from you last year, wasn't it? It was, yeah. It's great and it's really warm, but it has really long sleeves. And basically when you're walking, you tend to get caught on doors like this here and go, <laughs> Just need a lightsaber now. I didn't last shot long as a Jedi before I got my arm caught on something. So I'm going to make myself a cup of tea. Although I can't find me tea because look at this. Oh dear lord, we've got far too much food. There's only one solution. Eat all the food. And of course, it's got to be the brew loose leaf tea because it's fantastic. I'll need about three minutes to uh, Properly infuse. I love this teapot. When you pour it, it's got the filter on the top so you don't get leaves get leaves in your tea. And because these are full leaves as well, you don't get any little flakes in the bottom either. So since Mega Bird is now in the living room, I mean in the oven, I am going to put some beverages in the fridge because we need some books fizz going in there, don't we? This fridge is looking at mighty empty now with it. Without our uh, turkey. Don't forget, like, yes. What? You're the mega bird. Oh, am I now? But I was going to put one of my kegs in there. Don't, don't wander at me. Not all the cats are here. What are you doing on here? The cats are loving the fact that the table's clear. There's more places to explore. What do you want, Jane? What are you after? You just had your dinner, haven't you? You big shuffy kitty. This is the softest cat. He's the softest cat as long as he doesn't have catnip and then he turns in. He gets a little bit punchy when he's had catnip. Anyway, my tea. I'm going to have a Starbucks mug, I think. I'm going to have the Orlando Starbucks mug. I'm going to enjoy this tea now. It's lunch time. We're having bacon bam cakes for lunch. And also, I'm listening to monstrously epic post rock again. Because I don't like Christmas music. Very cinematic. Uh, I have no idea what the band is because I found them last night after having some beers on a playlist on Spotify which has all the best post rock tracks from 2017. Oh, look at this bacon. Looks good. Three slices each on one bone cake. This is going to be a heck of a butty. Don't drop it on your toes, it'll break your foot. Also the minute I got this on the stove, this turned up. Jen. Oh, he's ignoring me now, he's trying to be cool. So Jen's just had a bowl full of food. Turned his nose up at some of his treats because he's full from his bowl full of food. The minute I put bacon on the stove, meow, 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 I want some bacon. Cats, everybody. Cats. Yeah, you. You're cheeky, aren't you? Uh, Jam? 
I don't know where are you, but there's a stormtrooper stood next to you. This side? The other side. This side? Yeah. Oh, he blushed. <laughs> Hang on a minute. He's taking me off. <laughs> I think I think I've got some competition here. <laughs> so yeah, we do have a stormtrooper in the living room. We've also just tidied it. <laughs> He's quite tall. I think you're a bit too short to be a stormtrooper, Gemma. Is he this tall? Yeah. <laughs> that, that's better. Oh, he's off. So yeah, if in case you're wondering what this is, this is Pixel AI stickers for Google Pixel. So this 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 camp phone has a terrible video camera for videoing, but it does have some cool features, <laughs> including BB-8 rolling around the living room. And you've got to have a power, haven't you? <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is a no-fly zone. How cool is that? You can walk around it and everything. Oh, it's off. <laughs> uh, blimey, it's escal escalated a bit. That looks good, doesn't it? Get those juices on it. I thought you were going to drink some. <laughs> I'm sure I get it on. Oh, Spin the turkey! Spin the turkey. There's all juices inside of it as well. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. So we're going to do the calendars early today because we want to get this table out of the way so we can tidy the living room. Yes, and we've got lots of stuff to do today. Yes, so. and we can bend all this as well. 24. 20, you've been looking forward to this, yeah, haven't you? That's a big door. Ooh, I don't know why I was looking forward to it too much. I thought that was going to be like a... I thought it was going to be in a glass, but it's just a big tea light. Well, turn it over. I thought it was going to be like a... Yeah. Like a little thingy. Hang out. Does it smell like? It says it? votive and candle. Mm. No, it says one votive candle. Oh, okay. So, yeah. That smells of... Nothing. <laughs> it's kind of lightly friggin'. I expected oh. it to be like Christmas decorators. I'm a bit disappointed. I expected yeah. like some holly on it or something. But let's, let's just put it into um. It was four reality. quid. Yeah, this, ca this calendar was four pound. This was by far the cheapest calendar we bought. And we bought it from B&M Bargains. Yeah, it was cool. So for four quid. Yeah, it it's was not good, bad at all. Good quality paper. Yeah. It, nothing fell apart. Everything stayed where uh -huh. it was We've still got to. quite a few of the tea lights left to use. I would buy this one again next year. Yeah, because the, 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 the tea lights smell really nice. We use lots of candles. And it was, you know, because some of the candles you get, the bits fall into different compartments. These all stayed in the right place. Even though I chucked it around and the cats ran over it and mm -hmm. stuff like that. And yeah, you can even hang it up on your wall for that. So there you go. Yeah, I'd so there you go. Air Pure, b and like Bargains, four quid. Can't go wrong. Hotel chocolate. Would you want to tell everybody what you did earlier? I stood on it, but in this top corner. <laughs> yeah. We're on day 24 of Hotel chocolate calendar. This was £26. Pounds. £26. Pounds. So a bit more pricey than we'd normally pay. So it's the night before Christmas and all through the house, not a creature was staring, not even a mouse. And we're finishing on um, not salted of caramel. Pecan Prawley. Okay. I expected something different, mm. I think, in 24. I, I like this kind of the chocolate tonight, but I don't think I'll buy it again. It was too expensive. Mm -hmm. Some of the chocolates I wasn't too bothered on the flavours. Which ones didn't you like? Slightly caramel. So that's this Praline's not my favourite. I like the pecan mm. too. 
But yeah. Chocolate too dark for you on this one, isn't it? No, no. Chocolate's fine because of the pre pecan and the sweetness in it. Well, yeah, I'd definitely get a hotel chocolate calendar again because they do cheaper ones that are just the same mm -hmm. chocolate every day, but it's really nice chocolate, so yeah, yeah, it's that's nice fine. Chocolate. And that leaves the Star Wars calendar. And we get Santa BB 8. Santa BB 8. On a surfboard. That's a surfboard, a snowboard. snowboard. That's a pretty cool little minifig. The thing Why is, is though, the hat in a separate bag? Because Lego always do that sort of rubbish. The thing Just is, though, I will say about this, right? In previous previous Star Wars calendars, the Star the twenty four day has been an exclusive minifig. Yeah. I already have a BB eight because I've got a first uh, sorry a an X wing. A pulled X wing. That came. It's not Paul's X wing. Well, it's the one from the beginning of the film. Paul's X wing is later on. Not you need to put that in there yeah. to hold the hat on. Sorry, honey. Uh, so, but yeah, this is not an exclusive minifig. It's just a Santa hat of which I've got many, and a BB-8 of which I've got many. So yeah, but yeah, it's still a cool minifig though. He's struggling to get his hat on. Mine, oh, yeah, it's a bit crap. I like okay. it. It's from that scene in the film. You remember when he um, wore a Santa hat and snowboarded? On 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 Hoth. Hmm. Boop, 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 boop. It was a terrible impression of BB-8, wasn't it? It was, yeah. What do you think of this calendar? It was rubbish. I liked some of it. I liked some, okay, so I like BB-8, so uh -huh. I like BB-8. I like the minifigs. Yeah. And I like this. Right. That's about it. Most of, oh, I like this one too. But, I, what I would say is if you're a mad Star Wars fan, this is a fun calendar to buy. Yeah, but you can For Lego fans, or if you want Lego, go for the Lego City calendar because you get a lot more Christmassy fun things like Santas and the little scenes this, and you know it's... You could make all these other bits you probably got lying around from extras some other yeah, sets. Yeah, well yourself. some of them <laughs> could make her or... No, not the minifigs but these bits. Yeah, you've I probably, probably got, could, yeah. You've probably got all these bits lying around as spares from other sets that you can make all this with. Yeah, there were a few days that let down like that and that. Yeah, that's odd. But um, I would say if you're going to get a Lego calendar and you're not a massive Star Wars fan or you know you really want to see what the Lego cal Lego's all about, get the Lego City calendar because it's a lot better fun. And it would be nice, Lego, take notes. If you actually put in here what the thing is that you've opened, not all of us that like watch every single aspect of Star Wars, we don't watch Rebels and the, ca the kiddie cartoon ones that are on Disney Channel. So you could put the character at the back or the ship and a picture of it at the back. Mm. For the amount we paid for this, it wouldn't take a lot more to print a name of the ship at the back there. Yeah. Um, what was I going to say? You completely threw me there. Sorry. Um, With my Star Wars Lego <laughs> And I also think that all the pieces should go together to build a big set rather than yeah. lots of tiny sets. Because these will probably all just end up in a box now. We'll never use them again. For the most part. <clears throat> at least with the Christmas advent calendar there's bits of the so if you if you go back to our videos and watch for 2015 we opened the lego city advent calendar and a lot of the little bits and the minifigs from that set ended up on here so at least there was a bit of use for them for us because obviously we have far too much lego <laughs> i brought a few extras down actually over the period i brought the car from the modular set for the, the palace theater and i also brought the pizza van it doesn't really fit in but i just brought it down anyway Anyway, we're going to continue the day now. The vlog is not going to end here because it's still like one o'clock or something, isn't it? It's 25 to two. Oh, it's almost beer o'clock. Um, but yeah, so we're going to carry on with the day and we're just going to start tidying to this living room. Turkey. Yeah, and you need to best turkey. Oh, and I forgot to say the Lego Star Wars calendar was 25 quid. You can sometimes get deals on them if you avoid the Lego store because the Lego stores don't generally put things on sale. But places like Argos sometimes put them in a little bit cheaper. Um, so there you go. Do, 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 the Christmas cake. She's out. Free. 
There is a smell of rum fumes in the air, so don't stand too close so the whole ca camera will go. Up. Yep. So we just had a bit of a panic, didn't we? Forgot to buy ice and sugar. Yeah. Well, we have the best small corner shop. Oh, I mean, we do. it's like maybe about as big as this house in the main shop part. And they have everything. So I just walked in there on the off chance thinking otherwise we have to go to Tesco and brave the crowds. And they have ice and sugar. And Panic over. And as an ex-supermarket worker, the last thing I want to do on Christmas Eve is go into a supermarket. Yeah, true. Because people shouldn't have to be there today. No. But then people keep forgetting ice and sugar for the Christmas care. They do. But that's what <laughs> corner shops are for. Yep. Well, so so it's okay for people to work in corner shops on Christmas Eve, but not. Yeah, because they can, it's their own business, they can open and close well, it isn't when they want. Staff. <laughs> it's all family, isn't it? Okay, anyway, it's sorted. We're safe. Oh, and then we haven't turned this on as well. No, my little border. Yeah, we were watching vlogs, we were watching um, cheap seats. There we go. So you're going to do this cake now, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, I might time lapse you doing the cake on if that's okay. Okay. So people can see... No pressure, like. Yeah. No pressure to get it right first time, absolutely. Actually, it's more fun when you make mistakes because everyone can laugh at you. Well, you can find my uh, little bit to decorate it with and ribbon, which I think are up, up there. Yes, they are. I don't know what's over the ribbon there. Uh, you brought it on the other day, didn't you? So it's yeah. new. Is, is it there? Is it in my trays? No. Bits to decorate the tree are you in, in this paper here. Yeah. I'll decorate the tree. These are the decorate the tree. These are the proper 70s style decorations for a Christmas cake. I'm not telling them away, the classics. There's a robin missing though. I've seen the robin around. We'll go and get that. And we've got the robin as well. Have you found the ribbon? Mm -hmm. Oh well. It's it's awesome. Ribbon! <laughs> Good to go. And the cake's decorated. That's nice, that honey. Okay, turn it round. Well, turn you around so you can see the Merry Christmas thing. I'm coming to the flower place and sugar. Oh dear, it's all of your boobs as well. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? Yeah, I always like decorating my cake. Yeah, looks good, honey. Well, the simple. I like your bells. Well, I, I did think of the snowmen last year, so I thought I'd do bells this year. Mm -hmm. And that's just done with a, a Christmas cookie cutter that I've, I've got. Oh yeah. So, and then a little bit of apricot jam for sticking. Mm-hmm. And that's it. Smashing. Can't wait to give that a try then. Hi Gemma. Hi Mum. Remember the 10% beer we had yesterday? Yeah, that was horrible. This is today's. 12% yeah. So we're bush, st don't know where else. We're Ooh, stay it's a Christmas bush. We're staying in Belgium for apparently this is Belgium's strongest Christmas beer. It's exclusively it's an unpasteurized beer brewed exclusively for the Christmas period. Using water drawn from beneath the brewery. As opposed to a tap. Yeah. Okay. Maybe like Water drawn from a beneath the brewery is a tap because the pipes for the tap just run under the brewery. Maybe it's just sewage. You got. I'll hold the glass halfway. You can't hold it there though. Pa 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 pa. It's not a very big bottle, so. No, fortunately. Good. <laughs> You've left gin out in the kitchen, haven't you? With uh -huh. the turkey on the side. Gin. Come on, Jane. Have you eaten the turkey? I'll kill you. You throw it at the door. Come on, Jenny face. I'll go and get the cat. Right, let's give this a whirl. Oh, that's my last one. Yeah, okay. Cheers. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it's no? No. It tastes like medicine again. What's your rating? One. 
tastes like medicine. And that's all it tastes of. It's not the best, is it? It's got no flavour. It's just like bitter and It's because it. it's a strong Belgian ale. That's, it just tastes like a strong Belgian ale. Yeah. I would say probably two because it's better than the porter that we had the other day. I don't know, the porter at least wasn't that thick. No, one. I don't like that at all. This was the most expensive beer that we bought. This was about £4.50 for the bottle. It's because it's I mean, impossible. Like you go in there on your own. Yeah, um. That's because he wants the turkey. <laughs> All he wants is a drink of water. Oh, yeah, there's some water. I'll get, I'll get that from You could bring it and put it in that corner. Yeah, we'll do. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go with two on this one. It's very strong. It's not something I would drink normally. I wouldn't drink Belgian beers normally, to be fair. Um, I do actually like the normal version of Delirium though, which is the one we had yesterday. Gin. So this leaves, we, we do have other beers left that aren't Christmas beers. We got like tons of beers, but we oh, bought some specifically why? for these vlogs. So maybe we'll try those in a bit if you fancy as well. Because mm. there's at least one of those you will like, and the other one's a cider, which... Oh, we can try the cider. Yeah, we could try the cider, which has been, we've been told that it's, it's, um, it's a, it's a favourite. You secretly got some more of that Marks and Spencer cider. Unfortunately, no. And now we're going to show you what presents we got yesterday from uh, your family, aren't we? Oh, okay. Which will be nice. I have put some away. Yeah, you have. Yeah. Only the alcohol. <laughs> yeah, we got more we got alcohol. Bottom. You didn't put all of the alcohol away. No, no. Four bottles of red wine, mm. different ones. Are you going to sort the cafe? I'm going to sort the cafe. Um, you... What are you doing? What? I'll get you water. He doesn't want his water, he wants turkey. He's not having turkey. See, look, pick the water up and put it in here. And, oh, hang on, maybe he does want water. And he's like, no, there's no turkey in here, I'm not interested. What? They do actually have water upstairs in their own room as yeah, well. We just put some extra in. We're not like that mean that we would shut them out from water. Ow, you just sat on my back. Oh, my chance is on your knee. You're broken it. This is yours, isn't it? Yes, this is mine, yes. Ooh. Not like you want to put tags on things. It says do not open until the 25th. We were two days early because we opened them last night. doesn't put tags on things because she knows I like to recycle all the bags. <laughs> yeah, re-gift. I don't, I don't see why, you, no, I don't see why you wouldn't recycle no, these bags because the they're really nice bags. Yeah, they're really nice and let's be honest, what else are you going to do with them? So you got some vouchers. Mm-hmm. Those will be going on various things. And some Christmas smellies. Oh, you've got to get the Christmas get smellies. Christmas. It's quite handy actually because I was getting a bit low. Licorice all sorts. Yeah, this is your mum's tradition. She always buys me licorice all sorts and I really love licorice all sorts, so it's always appreciated. Oh, yeah, that's quite a strong one. King Goblin. I like King Goblin. That's nice though, yeah. And Is Hobgoblin. Two yeah. Hobgoblins. Hobgoblin is one of my favourites. I really like, so I had some of that last night. Another King Goblin. Another King Goblin. And I think that's your lot. Yeah, I think that's Unless your lot. I missed something. <laughs> no, you got golf, is it? Yeah. Look at this pretty bag. It's got a reindeer on it. <sighs> She's written on the tag. Well, you want to re-gift the tag as well? Well, I can just, I just do this. And then we can just leave that one off. So next it. year people will probably get these bags off us. Yes. And then hopefully the year after we get them back again. Because I'd rather they recycled them, more of them are made, to be honest. Pajamas. They're really nice, aren't they? they? Bambi on. I love the pants. Bambi. With all the little Bambi and That snow. sounded like thingy then, didn't it? Bambi. Um, My favourite. Bendix and Mayfair. Yeah. It's a big gone big again, well. doesn't it? Because mm. it went small for a bit. Christmas socks, because you have to have Christmas socks. You do? And these have got little robins on. Jolly robins. I like robins. And my, oh, staple for my mum. Chocolate coins. Mm -hmm. candy, candy cans. Candy canes. I need to put them on the tree. Yeah, I like and candy cans. We haven't bought any ourselves this year, have we? Oh. Look at that me. It's a snow fairy gift set from love. Awesome, I'm going to use that. Snow fairy is my absolute favourite, and you get <laughs> in here some shower gel um snow fairy body conditioner um a jelly bomb and a magic wand are you going to turn the bath into a jellied mess i'm going to turn the bath into a jellied mess yeah the box is gorgeous and 
that will also be gifted next year. <laughs> because it's beautiful. The, the bell will end up on the tree, probably. Yeah. I do like to make little reminders of Christmas past. Mm -hmm. Did you not get any coins? I didn't say any. Oh well. We've got we've got plenty anyway. I'm sure this. This was a joint present off my sister, wasn't it? Mhm. Mm so we got some Thornton's caramel crunch biscuits. Very nice. Which Mark might steal. I've not seen them before. No, no. The drive through to Nutton. Oh, another Christmas card for me to put up. Christmas card, a new idea this year with the Christmas card, by the way, was to have a ribbon hanging from the picture rail with all the cards pegged to it, and it's worked really well. The, the, I have to say, the fireplace looks amazing this year. And this is a really cool book, isn't it? Yeah, we really like our birds, I shall yeah. like them. But this is by Bill Bailey. Yeah, so we're really big fans of Bill Bailey. We really like birds. Double win on that book. Yeah, that's really good. And he's got there's all drawings and cartoons in here that Bill Bailey's done himself. That's cool. I'm looking forward to having yeah. a look at that. Smells nice as well. New book smell. That one smells nicer than a new book. Mm -hmm. And she got us a bottle of wine as well, didn't she? She got she did. a funny pig one. And. Where goes the, the world? world? I didn't even see that one being on. I don't know. If, yeah, Cause Light is not a good beer, but the rest are, so that's fine by me. Although I must admit, I've never tried Cause Light over here. No, it might be different. Mm, we'll see. Bud Light over here is worse than it is in the US. That's horrible, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Literally drinking water. The battery's running out on this camera, so I'm going to have to stop you in a moment. Well, you can stop now if you want okay. to put stuff back in. It's Always cool. helps to have three spare G7X batteries. So you've got a little... Bath. You got a little... <laughs> well, it's soft Declan and Jim, Yeah, it is, so... yeah. But it's just two shower gels, so you'll use these. Yeah, I probably will um, do actually. Especially you'll use the sponge thing because that's cool. There's one just a pistachio and magnolia one. Oh, actually that does sound nice. coconut milk with jasmine petals. Now they're so. going to work smelling like a tart sandbag. Yeah, so we, and we, we need a shower <laughs> puff. And then this bag was off my nan mm -hmm. and my auntie Debbie and my cousin Michelle. They've made us a little gift bag and we've got some Christmas classic quality Oh yeah, streets. you've got to have some Christmas okay, quality streets. Oh. Being at M&M's, awesome. Oh no, that's loud. I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we got a scratch card and we, we scratched it last night but we won £2. Yeah. So we need to go and trade that in at the shop. Yeah, if you can trade that in, I was going to say if you can trade that in before the new year, there might be a special lottery on it. Yeah, there might be. Wasn't um, the one on last night. Dinner party games, so the six great games including kazoos in here. Oh nice. Hum that tune with your kazoo. <laughs> I want a kazoo solo. I haven't played a kazoo in years. Yeah, I used to... Oh, I can do it. Oh, I'm, I'm eager for kazoo. Oh, they're weird kazoos. Oh, they're crap. <laughs> <laughs> the game that I ate in Ruby had last night with the kazoos. Was yeah, they're proper kazoos. They like boobazellas. They do. <laughs> mm. Oh, did you... This is not tune. Oh, that loud. <laughs> There's literally no... You can't play a note on them. No. <laughs> I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna thread it that tomorrow. There's not. The you can't play notes on that thing. The only way. The only reason. Yeah, because I could tell the notes you were playing, not the note. The, the note you were playing them at. Yeah, because that's, yeah, that's how you Imperial merch. And some more beer. Yes, of course. This is one of my favourites. 13 Guns is yeah. lovely. Never We've had never tried that before. one yet. And I, I like that one. I've had that one before and I do like that one. We've never had that one before, but I love that one. Mm -hmm. I'm just getting little tins. The Joker IPA is by the William Brothers Brewing Company. It's, it's gold within the glass and fruity on the nose. Sounds nice. Enjoy it chilling so that will have to go in the fridge before we drink it. Yeah, I need to get into the I habit of putting thing, the right beers in the fridge that should be in the fridge. Well, it's What's happened there? It's just rubbed off against it, yeah. I'm sure. It's probably um, the cat was jumping in it. Absolutely, <laughs> hair was jumping in it, wasn't she? I'm sure I can clean that off and re-gift it. <laughs> Here's a bag, it's got poo on it. <laughs> it's not poo, it's mine. That'll come off with a, a little bit of... Um, Elbow grease. An antibacterial wipe thing. Smashing. 
We've done, so, we've done well so far. We have. The next thing we need to do, and probably we should do this after I've had more beers, is build a gingerbread house. Oh yeah, we've got a gingerbread house. And I think I'm going to prep the legs tonight. We've got my carrots and parsnips tonight, so I don't have to do it okay. tomorrow. Because I hate doing that. So between no and Gingerbread House, I think we'll probably relax, watch some films, and yeah, let's get a film on. Yeah, let's and film and eat some crap. Yeah. Oh yeah, we, it's not crap. We've got good burgers. No, I mean let's eat some crap, not the burgers. Let's eat some crap. Oh, you want crap, do you? It's a bit early for burgers. Oh, okay, we got some Pringles in though. Could I have them? Do you like salt and vinegar Pringles? Mm -hmm. There you go. Oh, we got some beef jerky. I like beef jerky, but I'm not gonna have that yet. It's a so we're picking up where we left off last night on Home Alone 2 and we're eating lemon mint crisps. Get in. <laughs> and obviously this one is a little fat bugger and he wants to eat the lemon mint crisps. I will point out that this guy has got a bowl of food upstairs that you can eat but he's chosen our food instead. Of course it wouldn't be Christmas without watching Elf, would it? And also Gemma made me finish the 12% beer. So I know I'm a bit tiddly. I kind of deserve that one to be fair. Well, drink-wise, I've not touched a drop since we um, since I finished the Belgian beer. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hang on and get, let me get my second win later, maybe. Uh, but tea tonight is going to be these uh, burgers, which have got cheese in them, and we're going to throw more cheese on top. And also, we've got some ribs in the oven. Um, we're probably not going to do the gingerbread house tonight because we're we're going to relax. We've got lots of video footage. But what we are planning on doing from this point forward is it's maybe doing weekly vlogs because we've had so much fun doing vlogmas and it's been nice to look back and, at, at our own videos as well and see where we, where we were up to so so we're thinking maybe doing that in the future so maybe the gingerbread christmas house will be part of our first weekly vlog when we talk about what we did over the christmas week which will also probably include our christmas day Gemma is now preparing the table looks really good that huh I particularly like the bottle of beer in the middle of the table. That's I think that really that, finishes yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, she's even preparing our very classy Christmas hankies. Christmas hankies. Napkins. I told you that beer was strong. <laughs> ah, now it's time for a real Christmas film. It's that time. Christmas time is here. <laughs> This is Christmas Vacation, my favourite. It's been a long day for this kitty cat. <laughs> He's very sleepy. Long cat is long and And we end tonight's video viewing with the fantastic Muppets Christmas Carol. That's a hat trick of favourite Christmas films that isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> This cat is snoring. And there we go. So we're at Christmas Eve. Have you had a nice day? Being very relaxing. And that's been a good thing, I think, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. the camera full a little bit. You can't really see. We've got the moustache on the camera. So you can't really see the screen. So there we go. So yeah, so that was us doing Vlogmas. And from this point, the stars. <laughs> now uh, we're thinking of doing weekly vlogs from this point onwards because we've really enjoyed it. Um, it's been it's been an interesting time for us. Yeah. Uh, but I I don't know, but it's, I don't know about you, but I've quite enjoyed doing the vlogs. I've, I've enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah. It's been like gave us something to focus on. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I could do daily vlogs for the future. Because it's a lot of work. Especially when you work full time. It's it's not a lot of work. Uh, yeah. It, it's like what you do. Some most nights you come home from work and mm. you sit on the couch in your pajamas, which you've seen in vlogmas. Yeah. Um, and you don't do anything because you're tired. I've just realised you're not in your pajamas. I'm not in pajamas. <laughs> I'm dressed. 
I'm still dressed. But yeah, it, I, I can see what you mean. And then, I mean, the editing part is like, at the end of the day, you've done all the video and it's like, kind of just put it on the internet. No, because then you've got to edit it, you've got to add music, you've got to do the end, but you've got to upload it, you've got to claim. Oh, because, of course, YouTube says, oh, it's not suitable for monetizers because you mentioned the word badger or something, I don't know. Um, but yeah, other than that. But I think uh, weekly vlogs going forwards, just for just probably more for our purposes than anything, you know, yeah. like a, where we are in our lives. It's kind but of fun to do as well. It's, you know, pushing you to do something at the weekends as well because I was assuming people don't want to see you just sat around your house in your pajamas. Yeah. Drinking. <laughs> True. Um, well, I see that. And we're going to have to go out now in the week future. Uh, but yeah, it's. I think that's a nice thing to do, isn't it? And um, it, it's been really like positive as well because a lot of people have like posted nice comments, yeah, supportive, and put comments on. And, and just like uh, lots of views as well. I mean, every single episode to this point has had a hundred views, which for us is just insane, you know. <laughs> so I'm just really happy about that, and and it's been good fun. So, mm -hmm. but we so tomorrow. I think we'll probably be starting the first day of our weekly vlogs. So we'll do our Christmas day and our Christmas week. Uh, maybe look to post around maybe our usual Friday. I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. We haven't really decided. Uh, at this point, I'm in no fit state to actually make decisions. <laughs> so there you go. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you. And we shall see you very soon. Bye. And remember to like and subscribe. I never say that. And hit that bell button so that you know when we're posting something. I kind of feel like I don't want to say that anymore because... No, you know, what's the point? Because really you're watching this, you've probably already subscribed, so... Well, you'd be surprised from the stats, actually. Yeah, and true. Not, but it's, you know, it's like, it's, it's I don't... It's just, if you want to subscribe, subscribe. Do what you want to do. If you don't want to subscribe and you want to watch, just do that. Yeah, Whatever just you do like, what you want to do. It's, I'm pretty chilled about it. You know, so anyway, see you soon. Bye. Merry Christmas, everybody. Have a fab new year. That is a scary face to end on. That is a scary face I'll to make end. a less scary one. Why is your hand so small and your face is so big? That's better. That's <laughs>